For the next 10 in-game days, I will be attempting to become a serial killer in realistic RDR2. Because October is one of my favorite months, and it's spooky season, baby. <laughs> However, what classifies a serial killer is someone who kills three or more people in a small period of time. And I will be attempting to get a kill in each state in the country, which would put us over the three or more kill mark. But each kill needs to be a realistic. I can't just go in the middle of a town and kill someone. That wouldn't be smart. But someone in the woods alone might be a better target. If at any point I die or the cops get me, the serial killer story ends. And my journey will start all the way here in Valentine. Now, I'm a long way from getting all five kills. I'm starting with just a lasso, and honestly, I'm just gonna need a lasso and a revolver to complete all of these murders. So, I got a job cleaning tables so I could earn some money for that revolver I need. Let's start cleaning tables! I won't lie, it feels a little bit eerie and kind of creepy taking a job just to collect money for what I will ultimately use for murder. <laughs> Sorry, I just like saying murder. It's not a word you get to use every day. I got up to 23 bucks, but I needed at least 150 for a horse, so I picked up a long distance supply drop job. Say that three times fast. Okay, so it looks like this job is gonna be taking me all the way to Blackwater, so hopefully I'm gonna get a good payday from this. So, I guess I'll see you guys there. I made it to Blackwater, and boy, I ended up getting enough money for a horse and more. So I just needed to head back to Valentine, and I definitely did not steal a horse to get back there. As soon as I got back on day two in an ethical way, I made a great purchase. My favorite thing about these Red Dead videos is I get to say hi to a new animal friend every time. And this time, you get to say hi to Willow. Say hi, Willow. Please subscribe. Okay, I used the rest of the money to purchase a revolver, which I will soon be using. Now that I'm finally on the hunt for a victim, I'll be honest, it's actually kind of hard. Trying to kill someone in a realistic way is tough, because a lot of people are actually wandering around this world. But then, something special happened. Okay, I think I hear somebody in distress, which only means- Yep, she's right over here. I just got the marker for the map. This only means one thing, ladies and gentlemen. Please, we might have our please first help. victim. Please! <laughs> yes! Yes! Just lift go. as hard as you can! There you are, ma'am. Thank you, you say. Sure. Oh, of oh, course, of course. Sure. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, Alrighty. You've been stuck here and starved or eaten. You could have. Oh. You could have. Poor. All right, ma'am. You need a ride home, ma'am? I'm gonna offer her a ride, I just did. Oh, yes, mister, please. Thank you. I live over in Annisburg. No problem. Come on, ma'am. Come on the horse. My friends. This is our first victim. I don't normally travel this far alone, you know. It's just me and my boy now, and it's hard to find work. I was hoping right. to get a job working as a seamstress. A wealthy man said he'd pay me for okay, the work. Guys. He said he'd provide room right and board here. for me and for my child. He wanted I'm to meet take me her first. Out. You finding me is the only good thing that's happened to me in a long while, sir. Not sure about that. Is something the matter? Lord! What are you going to do to me? Save me! Okay, guys, we got her. Oh, and I didn't tell you, I have a house. This is where I will be bringing every single victim. Instead of just killing them and leaving their body in the middle of nowhere, they will be safe here. Okay, my friends, we've officially made it to the house. I assume I've told you about it. And this is where we will be taking our first victim. This next part might be a little gruesome. Well, my first kill was a success. However, I still have four more kills to go. Oh, and you're probably wondering, why am I showing you this hot air balloon? Why does it matter? Well, listen, you'll find that out in time. But seriously, don't forget about this hot air balloon. I want you to say out loud right now, I will not forget the hot air balloon. On day three, I stumbled across a man and his family making a house. How adorable. Okay, looks like we have a second victim potentially. I don't know yet. We're about ready to call it quits, to be honest with you. Okay. Listen, I, 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 I hate to ask, but, but uh, is there any way that you could help us get the supplies of that we need? Of course I can well, help you out. I ain't promising nothing, but yes. I'll see what I can do. There's okay. a logging camp over in Big Valley, pretty much straight west of here, that okay. might have lumber for sale. I'll definitely be helping him, all right. Let's go get that that logs. I ended up finding the lumber yard that was just west of the house, but there was a slight problem. Work. 
All right, I've made it to the spot. It looks like they're arguing, though. Um, okay, they have a wolf problem. Oh, yes, yes. Hello, sir. Yes. workers on the south side of the Yes, I will definitely fix your wolf problem. Be able to take care of that for you. Okay, let's do this. Oh my goodness! This is maybe not a great idea. Oh my gosh! That's okay. That's okay. Don't die, please don't. Oh my goodness. I ended up clearing out the wolf problem and nearly died in the process, and just as I collected my money, thinking it was over, I got a great piece of information. Not Excellent sure where I'm gonna be work. able to buy wood. Money's right there on the table. Bunch Thank you. Come back in a day or so. We should have some lumber for sale. Come back in a day. All I needed to do was wait a day to get some wood so we can help out our good old friend. All right, my friends, it's day four. On day four, I came back to this lumber yard and collected some wood. Yep. Dropped the wood off and had a nice talk with the nice man that I helped out. I can't Hello, you sir. Enough. Just as soon as we sell the house, you'll get your money back. Okay, I'm not really worried about the money, my friend. I think I'll be back pretty shortly tonight. Okay. My friends, it is game time. I've locked in this guy as my second victim. Here we go. Now, I'm gonna need to be careful because this man has two kids and I don't want them to see me take their father. So, I had an idea. My plan is to shoot behind the tent and hopefully they run and then I can see it. Here we go. Okay. I think he's running. His kids just ran away. I'm gonna get him. I'm getting him now. Oh gosh. He's kinda fast, I'm not gonna lie. Sir? Nothing personal here, father. Just needing to get you quick as my second victim. Welcome to the club, my friends. We have our second victim at our house again, where we've stored the last one. I'm sorry, sir, but this probably isn't going to be the best situation for you, my friends. Again, your discretion is advised. This next part could be a little bit graphic for some. I'm a serial killer at the end of the day. And serial killers must do serial killer things. We've done it, my friends. We've done it. Well, the second kill was a complete success, and I am now off to West Elizabeth. Now, I finally have two kills under my belt, one away before coming a serial killer. And trust me, there are a lot of potential targets in this area. Now, I'm not gonna lie, there are a lot of targets around here, including this man who is talking about something with the Bible that's not the Bible. I don't even know what he's really talking about, honestly. There's also this man who's using a harmonica. Sounds very good. But this is not realistic. But again, it's not realistic to just go into a town and kill the first person I see. So I decided to look more, and I saw a man alone in the woods on day five. Okay, my friends, I think I see my potential third target. It's a man alone in the woods, just with his dog. Pretty easy target, seems alone and vulnerable. I have set my sights on this man, and we will be attacking him shortly. Okay, it is officially nighttime. It is time to spring into action. Okay, I don't think he hears me, or sees me yet. But I, I don't actually. Okay, here we go. Hey, how did he see me? Sorry, sir. There's nothing personal. You just need to be the next victim. I'm sorry. Hey. We now have the third victim, and before you come at me in the comments, the dog is alive. Alright, that was easy enough. Well, that was easier than I thought. However, things started to feel a bit weird. Like someone was starting to figure out what I was up to. I was lucky enough to head to New Austin and find a quick target on day six. My friends, I think I have my fourth target. There's nothing much to do in New Austin except kind of find stranded campers. And I think I found one. It's just him and his horse, completely alone. And I think we have him in a very vulnerable, vulnerable position. Here we go. I've set my sights on this guy as our fourth target. 
Excuse me, sir. Oh, please don't do anything you're gonna regret. I said go. Relax. Oh! You're a feisty guy. Turn around. It's okay. You're just gonna come back with me. We're gonna have a little sleepover and have a good time. Willow, let's take this man back home. We're late for dinner. Now the fun starts. All right. Let's go. Our fourth target is here. You're gonna get a chance to meet our company. They're not much talkers. Alrighty. That was our fourth guest to join the house. My fourth kill was a success. But this time, something was different. Is that somebody? Yeah, that's a random person over here. Hey! Hey, get out of here! Oh my gosh, he's running away. I can't chase him. There's no way I'm gonna... What am I gonna do? Catch this guy? This guy's all the way over there. I don't think I'm gonna be able to find him, my friends. He's way too far at this point. Gosh darn it. Well, the man got away. Not much I can do. Now, I know it's been a couple of days, but I honestly haven't been able to find anyone in Lemoyne. And since I get my kills at night, I'm gonna have to wait even longer. And that weird feeling I had was continuing to grow. But I didn't have time to think about that. I found my next target on day 10. My friend, we've probably found the easiest target of them all. This man is sleeping currently in a little abandoned shack, it looks like. Um, I don't want to overestimate anything, but I do think this will be the easiest kill and this challenge will be done with. And this story will be done with. Okay, I'm going in. Alright, I want to be as quiet as possible, what but I do think he'll get up. Hello, sir. Be quiet. We have our friend here for our final kill. He will be our fifth kill. My friend, I'm sorry I had to do this. This is the end of your life. Goodbye. I gotta get out of here. Gotta get out of here. Alright, I'm gone. Oh my goodness! 